careful what you wish for. <laughs> no, this is a good news. Alrighty guys, welcome back to another video. We're continuing back to back. So just know that the last scene we saw was them moving out here to the ranch and continuing their new life. It's already been a couple of years. Jack is probably like maybe 12 or someone because the last time we saw him, he was five. Um, yeah, it seems like there's a big major area here. David wants to need to speak to you. Uh, there's some work to be done around the ranch. Let's do the ranch first and then that big huge blob that's there. Because I feel like the big blob is more of a mystery to do. You get me? Hopefully this guy doesn't get hey, tuberculosis Milton. later on. Can you give me a hand with this fence? Sure. Know much about fence building? Not really. Can't build a fence, can't milk a cow, ain't used to shoveling shits, but took on a gang of robbers single-handed. Guess we all got our peculiarities, Mr. Dickens. What was you doing before you came here? He knows. I told you. Wife got cheated out of inheritance. We was in a legal dispute. It was a bad time. That sounds awful, but I guess I don't believe a word of it. Hmm. I was raised to take a man at his word, and also to believe this is a free country. So free that I can't tell you what to think. So I guess it don't much matter what you believe. But I will work hard Wait, and his I belt. learn fast. Okay. His belt. Give me a hand with this fence. No wonder they asked him that. His goddamn belt has the... I'm eating Whoppers right now. But, um... Yep. There's plenty more to do. His belt gave it off. Just saying, hey. Pound it in there. We don't want it coming down. Okay. Again. Good. Now grab a rail, line it up with a notch, and place it in. Mm-hmm. Now, lift up the other side. You gotta line up, see? There we go. Now the next rail. But his Fine. gun belt, dude. He didn't... He didn't left that behind. He's just... No wonder they Good. asked him that question. He was a gunslinging. Okay. That looks okay. Go to the next post and pound that in. All right. I hope you've grasped the basics. I got other matters to attend to, but there's more than a day's work here for you. All right. So long. I'll be counting sections when you're done. Okay. Yeah, he gave himself away. But at least the guy wanted the truth. He didn't want the lie. And that's the only reason why he probably didn't kick him out. Cause he started speaking the truth right after that. So hopefully he keeps speaking the truth, you know. Jim Milton, over here. Uh, something's wrong. Put that fence down and get over here, boy. Quick as you can. Hurry. Hurry. Milton, get over here. Coming. Come on, give us a hand. Know much about bulls, Milton? Uh, just the basics. Don't make them mad. Angus Geddes, this is Jim Milton. Mr. Milton? Angus is your boss's son. Nice to meet you. Well, let's try and move this great hunk of Chuck. Come on, move! Oh, oh, oh. Oh, shit. I'll get him. Come on, I just, I just put up that fence. Shoot, shoot. Mm. He can do the same thing. Ah, uh, the rope is too small. I was trying to do like an educated guess on that. 
Let's talk. Whoa, whoa, crap. No. Great. Uh, don't. I gotta build that. His stamina is up, level seven, surprisingly. No, you don't. Now where are you going? How am I gonna calm this thing down? There, 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 there. Whoa, there. I'm surprised you're actually Whoa, able there. to actually keep him down. Easy, easy. So bad. Nice and easy now, boy. All better? Okay. <laughs> now come on, you hunk of chuck. This way. Got him, Mr. Dickens. Oh, good. They all left him alone, just grabbing it. How you doing, son? A bit sore, but I'll be okay. Thank you, Mr. Milton. My pleasure. Can you, mister? Fine. He just got my head. <laughs> good. There he is. See you later, Jim Milton. We'll make a rancher of you yet. <laughs> just ranch job, I guess. I mean, I don't mind doing it, just, you know. I don't know, she's gonna kill me. Coffee on. No morning, no Thank day. You. I'm headed to work today myself, Jack. Huh? So you stay out of trouble. Where are you working? I told you. I'm cleaning at the doctor's office. <laughs> Bye. Bye. <laughs> Give the place a tidy. Hmm. Okay, Pa. I'll see you later. I mean, he doesn't have none of his guns. Where are the other hands? Uh, I thought I said I don't rightly know, Mr. Getty, sir. Well, what good is that to me? We got three horses lost, possibly more, a mare about to foal, sir, and no hands to help with any of it. I'm supposed to be heading into town. This place is chaos. Hey, Pa! Can I get some help? Pa! Milton, Milton, you good with horses? I'm okay. I'll do whatever needs doing, sir. Good man. Can you help my boy, my youngest, Duncan? He will insist on riding Jeremiah, a horse that is far too strong for him. And my wife will need help with this mare. Abe? Sir? You and Dickens better not make any more mistakes like you did today, you hear? No, sir. Thank you. Both of you. FYI, there's a weight limit on horses, sir. So lose some weight. And you can Nobody's tell. Over here. Where's the guy? I'm good. You get on. Go find them horses. No, no, no. I'll show you. Since you showed up, runaway horse has been to some of our problems. Mm -hmm. And I am thankful for that. I ain't done too much. I ain't much of a rancher. Oh, heck. Hey, maybe them Laramie boys weren't so tough after all. Huh? Maybe I could have handled them. Of course you could. They're just loud mouths. Yeah. Honestly, they were. So, uh, is that what the boss is doing in town? Some business with them boys or something well when mr gettys goes into town well it ain't exactly for uh business oh uh okay then all right he'll be just at the end there well i better get two thanks kid all right now, this is fatherhood so i mean is my son gonna help me like you duncan I'm Jim. Jim Milton. Hey. Need a hand with that horse? No. Whoa. <laughs> you sure about that? Okay, yes. Yes, I do. 
Pretty big one. That's Jeremiah. Hey, easy now. Okay, Jeremiah. There, boy. Morning, mister. Whoa, none of that. Come on. Easy, boy. Oh, someone put some onions on their oats, didn't they, boy? Mm-hmm. <sighs> Calm down. He likes you. I ain't sure he likes any of us, but I'll make him respect me and behave. Can't you teach me how to make him behave same way as he does for you? I mean, I'm simple. supposed to go help your mother. She's got a horse in full. <sighs> That'll take hours. Well, training a horse can take hours. Just give me a quick lesson, sir. Please. Okay. I'm gonna take him out first. Burn some of this heat off of him. I'll be in the corral, Ben. The horse is easy to maintain, to be honest. As long as you have that that little chain in his face, or whatever you call it, I guess like a strap on in his face. Easy as that. If you want to exercise him, take him down the hill there. Where's the hillberry? Everything you got, come on! Alright. Do I just run around in circles or what? You got some energy? Show me then! I just run around the circles around this place. Yeah, boy. Yeah, Jeremiah. There's a boy. Does that mean it can also jump? Come on. Let it all out of you. Oh, we're releasing her energy, I guess. Come on. Where's that big mean horse? Mr. Milton. Get back on. I guess. I thought you were taking him for a ride. So I have to empty empty out stamina to calm him. Where's that at? They don't even give me a location, so I guess I just need to waste its energy. Alright, bet. I know one way to release its energy. Just to make it run straight. Let's go. Does that mean... Everybody else wasted their money like we need movie. They should have had at least 12k if they were to spit it with um with Abigail and her and him I mean. Is that why Dutch try to get rid of them? Cause they were gonna get like a lot more right, than good boy. they were supposed to. Give us no trouble now. There we go. He wastes his energy. He's ready for you. Okay. Get on up there and go nice and slow. Mm -hmm. Stay calm. Me? The horse. You're calm. My heart's beating a little. Keep your voice calm and your legs strong. Don't let old Jeremiah sense fear. I won't. Doing fine. Real nice. Not that I'm saying you need one, but... You sure there isn't another horse for you to ride around here? I had a pony, but I'm too grown for him now. Yeah? You think my son could borrow him? Huh. <laughs> Lancelot? Yeah. Sure. I'll get it hitched by your cabin there. All right. Thank you, son. Can I ask, are we in trouble from all these Laramie boys? 
Not they really. say Mr. Abel's real rich. Way richer than Pa. And he's got all these hired guns. Out of Laramie, and if Pa doesn't sell, well, they'll come here and they'll... Hey, easy there. You don't have to worry about all that. You just worry about Jeremiah there. Yeah, but... But... Just worry about the horse. Yeah? Yes, sir. I think you two might be ready to go out without a chaperone. Oh, I'm not sure about that. You're good. Nice and easy now. I mean, you're going in circles Both with him. You. That's a huge difference in going out there. Just take it easy. It'll be nice and easy. You, Mr. Milton? I thought you were going to help me. I am. I was. I'm sorry. Come on. I need a man's help. Duncan, what have I told you about distracting the hands? I'm sorry, Ma. <sighs> well, I hope you'll listen to me better than my husband. Thanks, Jim. You're doing fine, kid. Give him a carrot when you put him down. All right. Let's go help this woman. <clears throat> I know we can go back to the cemetery so we can get um Arthur's stuff. Honestly, it would be really nice if I were to have this stuff. What are we doing? So, you know much about birthing a foal, Milton? Not too much. Oh my God, where does my husband find men like you? Still, we all know where he goes in town, and it ain't hunting for hands. It's not too hard. You just uh, stick a hand in there and get a feeling for where the legs are. Go on. Whatever you say, ma'am. You're telling me I'm gonna have to stick my hand inside it? Oh, okay, they don't have me looking at it. Okay, now hold on. Then pull. Hold on. Come on. Oh. Okay, well, I think she's. Well, we're not out of the woods, but I think she may be okay. Great. We'll make a proper hand of you yet, Mr. Milton. I hope so. Thank you. Oh, and Mr. Milton, feel free to make a call at the house sometime. Perhaps even now. A drink to toast our new arrival. <laughs> I'd like that, but my wife is expecting me back. Oh, you're married? I didn't know we had any married hands. Yeah, we, we have a boy. Maybe you've seen him around? Oh, uh, I'm, I'm busy. Uh, too busy for social calls. Of course. Oh. Good day, Mr. Milton. I see what she was trying to do. You mistress. She was trying to wife up this dude with herself. See what she was trying to do. John. Jim. <sighs> Sorry. So, this is what you wanted. Fake names, which, by the way, Dickens sees clean through. John. Us on the run. John, this is our chance to make something new. Come on. Please. For me. For him. It's funny how Sally can actually go anywhere she wants. Knowing that she haven't done anything to Blackwater. Withdrawn. Quiet. And yeah. Jack. Sure. Take him out, please. Come on, boy. Let's go for a walk. Come on. More like a ride. Walk where? Round to the left. What do you see? The pony? Get on him. We're taking a ride. Duncan, Mr. Getty's boy lent it to you. Let's go. How you doing? Fine. Can we go home? Why? No. You're... Stay calm. Where would you like to go riding? 
Aside from home. I don't know. But maybe that stream. Good idea. Now you know all this. Get him going. Come on. You know. I like how he's trying to be like a father figure, but he can't. <clears throat> Just act confident, okay? Uh huh. Confident. Yep. Don't pull on the reins. You'll yank his bit out. Use your legs. There you are. Now let's go. Jack, a little kick and a. Now let's slow it down. Whoa, boy. See if we can handle the speed. Why don't we speed it up again? Okay. Come on. See, you can do it. How about you speed up a mic? Okay. Whoa. Don't let Jack go fast. Too fast. He may get. Okay. Slow, Jack. Slow. Easy there. Easy. Hmm. Faster. Let's bring up the pace again. All right. I think there's a good speed limit that he can get on. You can't tell me he's gonna jump off or get bucked off for that speed. Okay, let's go across to the stream. Yes, sir. can do it here we are yep we should get back you think you're ready for a little race I guess all right we go back to the path and up to the ranch okay on my go go I'm gonna let him win it's more like a father thing to do is to let their son win but I'm gonna just act like I'm actually gaining up to We're doing Yeah, that's don't not the full speed I don't think he knows of. Because I can beat him, but I'm just doing like a father thing would have done. Is let their son Are win. You still back there? Last straight. Come on. Hey up. I beat you! I beat you! I <laughs> Well beat... ridden, son. I beat you. Like I said, 
You're riding? It's gotten so much better. Thanks. Hey, keep practicing your riding. You too. You need it. <laughs> Why do I hear a gunshot? Investigate the... I don't even have a gun on me, for God's sakes. You want to watch your mouth, boy. You will be the first one we kill. Leave him alone. <laughs> oh, careful, boys. Careful. Yeah. Look at this tough guy. Get out of here. How fancy pants get is paying you to be tough for him, huh? <laughs> <laughs> no, he's paying me to keep the place clean. Oh. Said he had some problems with vermin. Oh, listen to this. Am Real I about to funny. kill people? <laughs> no! Oh, get him now. Oh, get him. Oh, I'll kick his head in, boss. Ooh. <laughs> they didn't hire you because you're tough. It's because you're stupid. Knock his goddamn brains out. Oh, boy. Damn it. I'm gonna smell like cow dung, boys. Oh. Yeah, you couldn't clean my boots. Why is he trying to go for a kill? When was the last time you had a bath? It's like that, huh? Oh, dear. Getty spins on women, saves on hands. Oh, it has to be having a good help me. Get off that man! Get off! He hit me first. Oh, you can fight, boy. I'll give you that. Well, how's your wife in the brawl? Leave my wife alone. Oh, she's real pretty. Get out of here. Oh, quite a temper you got. Imagine you're you're frustrated with your lot in life. Married to a shit shoveling farmhand. <laughs> What'd you do wrong to end up here? Leave my wife alone. Welcome to Big Valley, Jim Milton. Pleasure to meet you both. We'll see you again. And no, you, you won't. boy, tell Mr. Geddes we called. We'll be back. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Mr. Milton. Thank you. Don't worry about it. You stop acting like a goddamn storybook hero, will ya? What choice did I have? Plenty, you moron. Plenty. <sighs> They're picking on him. What do you expect him to do? Seems too quiet. Nobody's around. Something's up. We all get caught eventually, John. I guess the trick is to decide by who. Is that Dutch narrating his mind? I'm ending up there, guys. But if you guys like what you guys see, like, comment, share. Now, dear, I won't hear any more of it. Hello. All right. And uh, who knows what's gonna happen next? Sincerely, it seems like a very weird beginning, I guess you can say. I can milk the cow if I wanted to. But yeah, it it is weird, especially where Blackwater was more place that I discovered. This guy popped up now, and this guy popped up now. So if I wanted to, I could have visited them. Freely if I wanted to. I was uh, visit, uh, invited you to go hunting again with him at his cabin near... Okay. 